Yeah, Boolean theorems can be proved by proof by truth table, proof by perfect induction and algebraic method. Yeah, last classes we have proved some Boolean theorems by proof by truth table and proof by perfect induction. That proof by truth table means using the truth table we are proving that theorem. Pro proof by perfect induction means substituting all the possible values of the variables. Like then today we are discussing about the al algebraic method. In al algebraic method means the theorems are proved by using another theorems. Then we can consider some examples for algebraic method. First one, first question. Prove x plus xy is equal to x using algebraic method. Then prove. How to prove this one? That is LHS is equal to x plus xy. x plus xy is equal to. See from in this x plus xy which is the common term in x one exists there in xy is also one exists there that is x into 1 is equal to x this x into y is equal to xy that is we are taking x from this expression that is x plus xy is equal to x into 1 plus y because x into 1 is equal to x x into y is equal to xy so x plus xy is equal to x into 1 plus y then what is the value of 1 plus y 1 plus y is equal to 1 which there are properties of 1 by properties of 1 1 plus y is equal to 1 that is equal to x into 1 what is the value of x dot 1 x dot 1 is equal to x which is the theorem properties of 1 by properties of 1 x dot 1 is equal to x that is x plus xy is equal to x that is in this equation we take this x outside then x plus xy is equal to x into 1 plus y. 1 plus y is equal to 1 by properties of 1. Then x into 1 is equal to x by properties of 1 itself. So x plus xy is equal to x. Then second one, second question. Prove x into x plus y is equal to x using algebraic method. Then LHS is x into x plus y. X in, what is the value of x into x plus y? By distributive law, x into x plus y is equal to, this x needs to multiply with x, then x needs to multiply with y. Then x into x plus y is equal to xx, that is x into x, that is xx plus, what is the value of x into y xy that is x into x plus y is equal to xx plus xy by distributive law by distributive law x into x plus y is equal to xx plus xy then what is the value of xx which is this theorem x dot x is equal to x which is the theorem Idempotence law. By Idempotence law, x x is equal, in Idempotence law, x is combining with x. That is, x dot x is equal to x. So, convert this x x to x by Idempotence law. That is, x x plus x y is equal to x plus x y. Then again, take the take x outside. Then, by the previous 
problem same like previous problem we can take this x outside then that is equal to x into 1 plus y x into 1 plus y then what is the value of 1 plus y 1 plus y is equal to 1 which is the theorem properties of 1 so x into 1 plus y is equal to x dot 1 what is the value of x dot 1 x dot 1 is equal to x by properties of 1. So, x into x plus y is equal to x. Then third one, prove x plus yz is equal to x plus y into x plus z. Actually, this is the distributive second law. Using algebraic method. This theorem already we have proved by proof table, truth table and proof by perfect induction. Now, we are proving it using the algebraic method. Proof. Here, first we are considering the RHS. Then we are reaching to LHS. That is, RHS is equal to, right hand side, RHS is equal to X plus Y into X plus Z. This is the RHS. Then this one, we can write it as, first, this X is multiplying with X plus Z. Then Y is multiplying with X plus Z. First, X is multiplying with X plus Z. Then what is the value? When X, X is multiplying with second time that is X plus Z we will get XX plus X into X into X is equal to XX then X into Z that is XZ next time means first this, this, this Y is multiplying with X plus Z y is multiplying with x plus z means y x plus y z that is equal to that is here first this x is multiplying with the second time then this y is multiplying with this second time then when x is multiplying with this one we will get x x plus x z when y is multiplying with this the time is yx plus yz. Then, what is the value of xx? xx we can convert it into x. By which theorem? Using item button's law, xx is equal to x. Then, that is equal to x plus xz plus yx plus yz. Then, consider the first three terms that is x plus xz plus yx which is the common term in this one x is common in these three terms that is here x into 1 is equal to x x into z is equal to xz x into y is equal to yx then take, the, take x outside then we will get x into 1 plus z plus y plus then this yz is same. yz is same. Then what is the value of 1 plus z plus y? 1 plus z plus y is equal to 1. By which theorem? By properties of 1, 1 plus z plus y is equal to 1. So this one is equal to x dot 1 plus yz that is equal to x plus yz x into 1 is equal to x yz is same then that is equal to x plus yz that is equal to lhs lhs is x plus yz x plus the so x plus yz is equal to x plus y into x plus z that is First we are taking RHS, then for 
this x plus y into x plus z is equal to first x is multiplying with this term then y is multiplying with this term. Then when x is multiplying with x plus z we will get xx plus xz. When y is multiplying with x plus z we will get yx plus yz. Then this xx is equal to x by item potence law. Then this xz is converting to x. Then in the first three terms x is common. So we are taking that x outside. So that is equal to x into 1 plus z plus y. Then 1 plus z plus y is equal to 1 by the properties of 1. So that is equal to x dot 1 plus yz. x dot 1 is equal to x plus yz. So that is equal to LHS. Fourth question. Simplify a b bar c d bar plus a b bar c d plus a b c d bar plus a b c d algebraically. Simplify this one algebraically. Then this is the term that is equal to from the first to consider this first to two terms which is the common term here a b bar c d bar a b bar c d which is the common term a b bar c then take this a b bar c outside for the first term a b bar c is common so take a b bar c outside then we will get a b bar c into here which is the remaining thing d bar here which is the remaining thing d so first term is changing to a b bar c into d bar plus d then third and fourth term in third and fourth term which is the common term which is the common thing a b c is common in third and fourth term see a b c is common here which is the remaining thing d bar here d is remaining so a b c into d bar plus d what is the value of d bar plus d? Which is the theorem? Complementarity law. One variable combining with its complement. That d is combining with its complement. So this is complementarity law. By complementarity law, d, bar, d plus d bar or d bar plus d is equal to 1. So d bar plus d is equal to 1. Then substitute d bar plus d as 1. See, a b bar c dot 1. Here, a b c dot 1. What is the value of a b bar c dot 1? That is equal to a b bar c. a b c dot 1 means a b c. By properties of 1. Here, which is the common term? In these two terms, which is the common term? a is common. Then, c is also common. That is, a c is common in this term. A then that is equal to AC into B bar plus B. What is the value of B bar plus B? B bar plus B is equal to 1 by complementarity law. So that is equal to AC dot 1. AC dot 1 is equal to AC. You by properties of 1. 